and just for my knowledge, what what when did you guys? When was your first practice date? Like, do you remember the date? The, the year? <laughs> it was about the last year. I mean, I, I I call it a band, but we're not a band in a traditional sense. We're kind of a songwriting partnership, really, aren't we? I mean, we and then we we well, you you saw our, one of our very first gigs, yeah. um, which was really a bit of a not an accident. We just couldn't turn it down. It was too good an opportunity to to play, really. Um, so we never we never we never planned to play live. So because we never rehearsed in a traditional way, yeah. right? Um, so yeah, I mean, we did try going in a rehearsal room for a few weeks, and it was very odd. Yeah, <laughs> it didn't feel like us. It didn't feel like our thing. You know, it wasn't. I it mean, with with Andrew too, the three of you were together, and it just with Andrew too, like with. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it was the. It would have been after the after COVID Christmas. Yeah. So we were talking about it that that uh, that holiday. I just started going out with Adamar, and she was kind of saying, "Look, you stop talking about it and do it." (laughs) (laughs) We were trapped in this bubble because we couldn't go out. You couldn't mix with. I think I just had COVID, so I was feeling really miserable. And yeah, we just. and when we we had previously had a late night uh, kind of jam session where we, that where the nine o'clock nasty name came from, but we hadn't actually done any recording. And then I think I just went on Amazon and bought the the the, the box and had to learn how to do the recording part. Mm-hmm. Uh, and we were just really writing songs for to entertain ourselves. Yeah, and, yeah. And of course, once you've written them, well, you've got to make a YouTube channel to. <laughs> and then you go on Google and you say, "How do I get all my songs on Spotify?" And and you kind of went from there. And it's, yeah, it's been a real journey, and it really amuses me because people do kind of say, "Well, how do you do what you do online and everything?" And I was like, "I've got no idea." <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, um, okay. it, it's trial and error, repeated day after day for. That's four disingenuous. Years. That's it? true, though. But it is. It's not. I mean, you never know it's going to work. No, but you make a good study of it, and I'm, yeah, I'm, yeah, they, you, I'm, yeah. we're really fortunate um, in that. Yeah. It's not, you know. But you know what, but you know what, musicians are like. You know, ninety percent of them are dickheads. You know, so, um, <laughs> so it's not. No, 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 that's <laughs> jobs. That's athletes. Ninety percent of athletes are dickheads. Only seventy-five percent of musicians are constant. Oh, sorry, I've got my percentages mixed yeah, up. Yeah. You are. 